Hey everyone, this is Tony Teaches Tech. I'm Tony, and in this video, I'm gonna show you a website that I built to help you find short available domain names. Now, this was a problem for me. I wanted to find a short domain name, but I couldn't find a good resource on the internet to allow me to do that in a automated way, in a systematic way. I would manually have to search for like short domain names, and it was just, a, it wasn't a good experience. So I figured I could build something uh, better that not only I can use, but I can share with everybody else so they can use as well. So what I did was I built a website called Micro Domains. It's available at micro.domains. And this is a video that is kind of like a self-promotion video to, to show you kind of how to use this and just to expose you and let you guys know that it's available. So let's go ahead and look at this website of mine. So it's, like I said, it's at micro.domains. That's the URL. And, um, when you go to the homepage, you can see a search engine here. So this is a short domain name search engine. And what it does is it allows you to find a short domain name with either three, four, or five letters that's available for registration. Okay, and, and right here by default, it's sorted by uh, purchase price. So the cheapest short domain name that you can get is $3.48 per year. Uh, after that, the renewal price is $27.88 per year. So um, the, way, the way this whole website works is I... I teamed up with Namecheap. Um, so if, say you did want to buy the domain name eq.wtf, if you click on this, um, it'll give you some key insights about it. But when you click on this link here, buy this on Namecheap, it'll actually take you over to Namecheap's website where you would be able to continue with the purchase of that domain name. So I don't actually sell any domain names. I don't register them for you. I just kind of aggregate them for you and allow you to search for them. So here you can see on Namecheap's website, like I said, it's $3.48 per year. And then the normal, that's the promotional price, I guess. And then the uh, the normal yearly price would be $27.88. Um, back here, um, there, there's a bunch of features. Like if you're looking for a specific domain name extension, like if you wanted a, a .io uh, top level domain name extension, you can filter by that and then you'll see all these results here. Um, if you only want it four letters or less, let's see if there's any available here. There's no four letter or less .io domain names available. But one, one thing that I think is really interesting after building this and looking at some of the, the statistics behind it is you'll see here that we're looking at five letters or less. These are starting at $3.48 per year. But if we filter this down to four letters or less, all the available domain names that are four letters or less for domain name registration, we're bumping up to minimum $58.98 per year. And then if we look at domain names that are just three letters, okay, three letters and a dot, that would be anywhere from $359,000 for the purchase price. Uh, luckily, it's much cheaper for the renewal price, um, all the way up to $13 million and maybe even more than that. So, but but these are like, these are some of the rarest, coolest domain names out there. Like uh, B.me, that's, that's a, such a cool short domain name. This reminds me, and I have it on the website somewhere, um, like three letter domain names, like Twitter has t.me, t.co, m.me is Facebook, a.co is Amazon, and like the same thing for the two letter domains, fb.me is Facebook, wa.me is WhatsApp, okru is a, a social networking service in Russia. So um, I don't know, maybe you're different than I am, but this is just a, a really cool topic for me. Um, what what else, I actually, I actually use this search engine to find a domain name for myself. And I'll have another video about that, uh, that you can watch about another website that I built. But one of my favorite features of this search engine is the fact that you can search for a specific keyword. So if I wanted a short domain name with a specific keyword in it, I can do that. So let's look for my name. If I wanted a domain name, a short domain name with my name in it, there's one option available. Uh, so you can see T-O-N-Y would be 2.nyc so 2.nyc would be the domain name it's a little bit out of my price range um, but the renewal price is not that bad so another example um sun like up in the sky if you want a domain name with sun in it you can look for that and you got you know you're prefixing sun with an m in post fixing it with the u for 30 bucks a year but i think more or like su dot N E W. It still has the word sun in it. Sun.fm. That's an option. 
and then you have these ones that end in .uno, cs.uno. Um, so you can see how that could be powerful. What's another one like, yes. Let's see if we get any results. So yeah, there's a couple couple results with yes in there, cy yes, um, and these are reasonably priced. And you know, the, the more, I guess the less popular the domain name is, the more extensions you can see. So for, for this es extension, if we click on that, um, if we don't want to buy this, there are 3,000 other short ES domain names available. We can see, and this is another feature that I added in, how over time, I released this this uh, back in November, this website, but how over time, back in November 16th of 2020, there were 5,000 short ES domain names available. But if you move along to today, present day, now there's only 3,583. So these are increasingly rare domain names. So that's, I, I think that's one of the values of having one of these short domain names, if it makes sense for you. Because honestly, if you project this out just like a couple more years, a lot of these domain names are going to be gone. Just literally in three months time, 1500 of these domain names were bought from there to there. And I have one of these charts for all the short domain names. So like dot, dot .io, that top level domain name extension. You can see somebody somebody went on a buying spree between December 27, 2020 and the 29th. They bought a whole bunch of short domain names. And this list is just getting less and less. Um, at this point, what's also interesting is .com. There are no short .com domain names. They're all gone. Uh, every single combination, every possible combination of a a a b a c a d dot com, they're all gone. So um, you get some cool insights on this website. You can uh, find something valuable if for yourself um, if you're looking for a short domain name. And and I the benefit is clear. Like if you have a short domain name, it's usually more memorable than a much longer domain name. Um, so that's one of the reasons that I like them. Um, and and. The way this website works is I'm, I'm giving it out free as a service, but if you do come in here and like I showed you before, if you want to buy this, you click out to Namecheap. Um, that is going to, I'm, a, I'm an affiliate for Namecheap, so if you buy that domain name from Namecheap, then I'll get a small uh, one-time commission from that purchase. So that's how I'm able to operate this website for free and allow you to search all these short domain names for yourself. So um, guys, it's at micro domains here, micro dot domains. Check it out. Let me know what you think about it in the comments below. This is one of my uh, many projects that I do on the side in addition to making videos on this channel. So um, I appreciate your support if you go and look through there for a short domain name for yourself. Um, thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe for more videos from me in the future. And if you do, I'll see you in the next one.